Strange is your world. On June 13th, 1966, something happened in Enigma, Ohio. Something that no one talks about. Something that led to the permanent disappearance of over 500 students and the closing of Etna High. For over 30 years, the children of Enigma have been growing up wondering what is it that their parents won't talk about. They're about to find out. My dad's starting to get suspicious about all the time we've been spending searching the school. Well, what did you tell him we've been doing? Ballet. Ballet? Mm-hmm. Hey, it was all I could think of at the spur of the moment. <laughs> I mean, you know how adults start tripping whenever you mention Etna High. <laughs> so you told him we were taking ballet? I hey. mean, that's the best you could do? <laughs> it was a spur of the moment thing, you know? What are you gonna do if he wants to see like a few dance steps? You gonna do a little dance thing? Hey, I guess I'm gonna <laughs> just put on some tights and do my best. That's a scary thought. Yeah, it's a <laughs> What was that? Let's hope it was just rats. Rats? One big, big rat. Oh, big rat. you mean one big weasel? Yeah. Well, uh,. Come on, Barishnikov, let's go ballet our way. Ah, uh, huh? Very funny. Welcome back to that same uh, play that you da da da. But there's something, never something, since you've been around. And there's a, that is a, but it's too big. Who the thought that need ya? Who the thought that do? Back there, where we did that, baby. Well, you getting down the side, but you got it on the spot. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Well, there's always somebody that's got to show up early, isn't there? Emily, look at you. Long time no see. Come here. Yes. My name's Chris. I think you should know that by now. Oh, somebody's really full of themselves, aren't they? <laughs> How you doing, buddy? Good to see you. What's going on here? Oh, well, aside from the snubbing your girlfriend just gave me, not a whole heck of a lot. <laughs> What's with all these decorations? The reunion. What reunion? And she's not my girlfriend. <laughs> right. How can there be a reunion for the class of 66 when they all disappeared? Let's try not to get so bogged down in the details, shall we, Emily? Why do you keep calling me Emily? Okay. Now, the really hard part here, I think, is going to be picking out the food. All right? Now, what do we want? I had a menu here a second ago, and there was a picture of a sandwich, and it looked <gasps> delicious. I can't find it. I'm upset. <laughs> now, here you go. What do you like, Emily? My name mm. is Chris. Okay. You don't have to help if you don't want to. But let's not hear you complaining if you don't like the food that we pick out. Okay. I like these little party meatballs. Yeah. 
Me too. You know what? Not everybody, though, likes meat. So follow me here. What we could do is get some Rice Krispie treats and just dump them into a big kettle of spaghetti sauce. I got some Prego in the basement, but I think it'll still be good. You're actually trying to tell me that the last senior class from Etna High, which has been missing for over 30 years, is having a reunion? Who's that talking? Is that someone who wasn't interested in helping, Emily? Thank you. Sandwiches. We gotta have sandwiches. The big subs, not like those little finger food things, because I don't, I don't like those. Yeah. Why do you keep calling me crust? Emily? Now, the caterer has a picture in here of a scrumptious looking foot long sub. I tell you, the way I understand it is to die for saliva dripping, jaw dropping. Now, how many do you think we should get, partner?